birthday girl hey birthday girl that's a place that she wanted to come in here for her birthday so i decided not to go to atlanta this weekend so we are going in here because something that she wants Trying to look like you're winning. I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen. Soaking in moments we live in. Yeah, you got the nerve to be on me. Faking your Adam. <laughs> so we're here for a pretzel, right? What do you want? Cinnamon pretzel. Cinnamon? Do I have to say happy birthday to you? You don't have to if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think it's the one that's really yummy, though. Hey, sir. So you're going to white gummy? I think I want that blueberry. I want that. Huh? I can see that. That's how it's a pretzel. Yes, it's the, you see the pretzel pizza? Um, the pepperoni? I don't look at that pretzel meat, though. That was the same thing. I was looking at that right there. All right, stop. Stop. Everybody here? Happy birthday. Hey. I'm glad it's my birthday. Happy birthday. Wait. Get your drink. Oh, now you want something else. Yeah. Okay, the drink is the white gummy, though. Oh, now you want a drink and a white gummy? Or you uh, want the white I'm, gummy? The white gummy. All right. And I don't know what is on that glass right there. I want the blue raspberry. Blue raspberry? Yes. That so, looks so good. I wish it was lemon, but it's blue raspberry. Um, Amy, blue raspberry, please. So guys, she came for her birthday stuff and this is what I end up getting. And I can't wait to see what it's gonna taste like. And if you wanna know where we at, bam y'all. Okay guys, we're going for a taste taste. Oh, that is so good. And I'm gonna show you, they're making hers and you have a what? They have her. She's getting a white gummy. This tastes so good. Man, this tastes good. The minis. Yeah. I got a and I'm getting a brain freeze. Thank you. Okay. He's with us. Let's check his out. This is what the birthday girl got. So she got the gummy. White gummy. What it is? White gummy. The white gummy. So guys, I also got me some mini pretzels. If I can get it at my bag. So I'm gonna show y'all my mini pretzel dogs. And my mini pretzel dogs. And this guys is so good. That is so good. I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen. Soaking the moments we live in. Yeah, you got the nerve to be on me. Faking your life for the hygiene. Hello guys, welcome back to Viology and welcome to the V Hive and Life with Ambriana. So guys, today is my baby's birthday. She is 17 years old today. Today is October the 4th. And guys, it is something special she wants to do for her birthday. She had a day over yesterday to spend, to bring into her birthday. But today, guys, is something else that she wants to do for her birthday. So, uh-huh, I'm going to let 
her take it over okay so today i wanted to take some of the money that i got for my birthday and i want to feed 10 homeless people and it's something that we used to do when we were little when we used to live in south carolina and i feel like because i can be able to do it that i should do it so that's all you have to say so guys, this is something that I have raised my children to do. There are someone out there always that is less fortunate than you are. And I raised all three of my children alone. For 21 years, I was a single parent. And these three little kids have mm -hmm. never ever wanted or needed for anything because mama made sure everything was taken care of. But in the process of, of it all, I made sure my kids know that, hey, you are blessed. Although it is mama working and doing it all by herself, there are other people out there that don't have and excluding children. So um, I just nicely, we would do bags, fruits. Um, sometime Thanksgiving, we would do fruit baskets. Well, fruit bags. We always did the handy dandy paper bags. We would get paper bags and put fruits in there and also um, give them a bottle of water. So um, we came back from a trip from Greenville, South Carolina one day, and we had lots of things still was in the trunk of the car. And my kids saw a homeless man and they were like, mama, stop. We see a homeless man. We have so many things in our trunk and we want to give him something. So everything that we had in our trunk that day, my boys ran over. If I do have that picture still, I will insert it. Um, I'm not sure if I have it, but I think I do. So my boys did go over to the homeless man. They are not afraid of him. Um, the only thing we are using lots of precaution because of COVID-19. So we have to use lots of precautions now, but nevertheless, we're going to show you what we have, um, what, no, not what I have, what she purchased with some of her birthday money to feed. Um, we were going to do 17 people, but she decided to do 10 homeless people and, um, I'm gonna show you the items and then we're gonna show you how we're gonna bag them up and the bagging process. I'm gonna kind of like speed it up and then we're gonna go out to um, where I noticed that I did see some homeless people some months ago. So we're gonna go there and hand out the bags. And also guys, if you don't know about Tosh Time, I will insert her YouTube channel here. Tosh Time, Tosh is like my sister. She is my California sis. She has been going out for the last week. And before then, um, lately she's been going every day and feeding the homeless. And it's a lot of YouTubers have sponsored her. Tosh, thank you so much, sis. Thank you so much. And all the ones that did donate to Tosh, to, for Tosh to do this, thank you also so much to do this. This is something that um, I think a lot of people need to open their eyes to. It's always, me, 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 my, 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 I, I, I. And you forget about that, you know, God has blessed you for that. So share some of your blessings. And that is what I in, put in my children. You have to share your blessings in order to get blessings. But never who less, um, let's go ahead. I'm gonna show you what we have. And I'm gonna show you us the bagging process. And then we're gonna go out to feed the homeless. So, okay guys, stay tuned. So these are the items that we picked up and um, she was given Lunchables, chips, um, a Kool-Aid pack, some bear claws, two different flavors, and also some bottles of water. Check for me. Taking time out to be and live my life off screen. Taking time out to be and live my life. I'm in a place serene and pure and free. Hey, I ain't worried about what's the way. Only. Yeah. 
Don't take it personal I ain't lying I ain't hiding I've been grinding Multiplying I've been trying to get my weight up Staying prayed up Meditating and and guys, because they did not have any more of those, so what we decided to do, the ovens did have um, some little mini candies in there. So we just got two of the Lunchables and got the mini candies and gonna put it in the bag together. So we just did that to make sure that it still accommodate for the same amount. I'm on hiatus. Okay guys, the 10 bags are ready. And this is the overview of what the bags look like. That one has chips. Hmm, yes, it's down in that corner. So all of them are packed and ready to go. So guys, it is time to go feed the homeless. Okay guys, um, the last bag that I showed you, what I decided to do was to break that bag down because it was two of the Lunchables and I look in the pantry, my kids are not doing any chips, cookies or anything like that right now. So I did have um, some peanuts and also I had, I had some more water. So it do have a water in there. And that is the Lunchable that I told you that I had two of those. So I separate. So now we got 11 bags. Um, also, I had some pretzels. And I don't want to mess up the bag. I have a pack of cookies in there. And all the rest of them had a little sweet goodie. So the pack of cookies was in there and I put a Swedish fish in there and also their pack of Kool-Aid mix. So um, yeah, so that is the 11th bag. I decided to break that bag down. So she would be giving out to 11 people. So hopefully we do see 11 people to give out to. So now we're off. Screen, time out to be okay guys. Um, we have given out a good many bags, but I want to tell you something that we just found out from one lady that is a homeless lady. They stay at the Salvation Army. Um, she said they have to line up at a certain amount, a certain time. The ladies have to be there a certain time and the men have to be there a certain time. Well, um, what she told me was the men can have food up until four o'clock. They cannot take food inside the Salvation Army at all. So um, it is currently here, what, almost three o'clock. But um, I asked her if she wanted something, she didn't. But it was a blessing thing as we were driving down. There are some people that has a lot of food that they grilled and they're grilling the hot food out there for the people. I mean, that is like, a total blessing that's that's a blessing that's a blessing so um where we were driving we just gave out a whole bunch of bags to people but when we were coming down to go back over because i saw some more people that we gave bags to and we could not find gloves guys so this is the reason why i did want the items in a bag and we always do bags regardless and we hand from the bottom of the bag because they usually grab from the top of the bag so we always are cautious we do have our masks so um we are doing safety measures most definitely there's a person right there um i'm gonna see if this man come across he is in a wheelchair so i want to see if he's going to come across to see if i can give him a bag. I see somebody else here. This is an old, like, broke down store. I'm going to flip the camera back. Um, I don't know if I was recording the first time. My kids said, Mom, you wasn't recording. So we did give out to a good many people. And we still have some more back there. And I want to make sure that we get all 11 bags out. Okay, there's a man right there in the wheelchair. But if you can see, oh, that truck just went in the way. It's a lady sitting on the ground. So, um, I want to go over there, but the traffic is kind of like testy and I don't want to get in an accident or anything like that because it is a busy road 
over here. I don't know what to do at this point. Um, I think we're gonna give the person that's sitting here because um, we do see a person sitting there. So I wanna get something to that person, but I want to go to this man and the lady that's on the side of the road. And a lot of people don't even, you can see Mercy Flashes and people don't care. So um, I just don't wanna be in an accident or anything. So um, never who less, and you know that's my word, never who less. Um, Let's venture out and see if we can find some more people. Give these to these three and see if we can find some more people. Okay, we saw the people up here. And maybe we can get enough of bags out quickly. Um, ask them if they want some goodie bags. guys today's my daughter birthday and she's giving out goodie bags y'all want some all right we need uh thank y'all this is me and my woman thank you all uh, thank you are so welcome thank you Happy you're birthday. welcome y'all bless y'all all right we need you one more baby Thanks. Okay, hey, you're so welcome. Did he get one? Okay, and let me get it. All right, y'all have a blessed one. You're so welcome. <laughs> you're welcome. Bye bye. You're welcome. Thank you. So guys, um, I'm getting ready to show you. This is where I knew a lot of homeless be, and that is right here in this area. It's up under the bridge. But um, we have been so successful. We gave out all 11 bags, yay! So guys, yay, yay, yay. We gave out all 11 bags, and that felt good. So baby girl, are you happy? So that is what she wanted to do with part of her birthday. So um, it was a success. It was a success. Um, I do have plans for the day before Thanksgiving to, there is something that I do want to do. Um, the week of Thanksgiving, I want to do it. And that is, make my mom's homemade soup and i need to find um i know online because i watch um mom the ebayer and it's something that you can plug in to keep the test stuff and it has a plug so i want to find out um i know they have the big stock pots and you can plug them in so I've never invested in one, but um, this might be a great investment to do. So um, I might invest in one of those pots and one of the connectors because I do have those type of plugs in the very back of my automobile that we can give a cup of hot soup, cornbread, and also a bottle of water. If we can do hot cocoa, I would do hot cocoa or hot coffee. So guys, um, this is the end of this video and baby girl, stick your head up back there. So was your birthday a success? All right. So guys, um, this is going to be somewhat of a lengthy video, of course, because I am going to combine her day one and two together her birth some of her stuff from yesterday which was saturday and today is her birthday the fourth so i will combine all of it together so guys please like comment share thumbs up my video and if you are new to the beehive hi i am vandessa um theology and my daughter do have her own channel also it is yana gaming and also she has life with ambriana so guys um 
yeah we've had a blessed day yes we did so um i'm gonna go home and do a little something else for her not sure if i'm gonna put this in a video but she also have a photo shoot tomorrow so um she'll be getting all dialed down all pretty up for her photo shoot so uh, one day this week hopefully i will be able to get her photo shoot um up and show you part of her photo shoot but never who less love y'all guys i'm bye Stay and pray to meditating and taking time away. You always posting up pictures, trying to look like you're winning. I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen, soaking in moments we live in. Yeah.